I'm sick of Obama's wife. <laughs> yeah. This isn't some Republican rant either. It's just kind of first ladies in general. You know, I don't know what it is. All throughout my life with each presidency, like these first ladies, they've just gotten more and more like, like, uh, like chatty. You know? More and more chiming in, like leaning into the frame, <laughs> spitting out their ideas. It's just like, well, why are you talking? Right? You weren't elected. Shut up. Your husband's not running a lemonade stand here. He's running the country. You don't just chime in. Let me guess, is this considered sexist? It is? Why? Well, okay, you just nodded there, lady. Let me ask you this, all right? Let's say you had a leak in your house, okay? You call a plumber up, he shows up, and he goes, yeah, I think the leak's coming from the upstairs bathroom. We need to shut it up, blah, blah, Then all of a sudden, his wife walks in, who isn't a plumber? And then goes, hey, you know, I'm actually thinking it's kind of pretty nice. Hey, wouldn't you be like, with all due respect, shut the f up. I need a plumber in this moment. I'll extend an olive branch here. All right, at some point, there's going to be the first female president, right? Exactly. Which means at that moment, you're going to have the first male first lady, right? And when that happens, that dude needs to shut his trap. I don't want to hear a word out of him. I want to hear from the president. You, sir, go do some first lady stuff, all right? Go get yourself some gloves that go up to your elbows. Smile and nod during speeches. Go put your own flair, redecorate in the White House, right? Which leads you to Michelle Obama, right? Now she's sitting there holding up those hashtags. Remember that hashtag, bring back our girls? Remember that? It's like, I, it blew my mind. It's like, why are you showing me that? I'm a stand-up comedian. Like, what am I going to do to get those girls back? Why don't you look across the dinner table? It's like, you see that guy? That is the leader of the free world. Tell him to pick up a phone, call some Navy SEALs and solve it. What, what am I going to do? Show up with a sharpened mic stand? Hey, Michelle said to bring him back. Oh, it's unreal. I'll tell you what kills me. Hillary Clinton might run. She might, she might run. That, that blows my mind. I mean, honestly, she became a senator. She went from being the president's wife to being a senator. Just like that. Lateral move. That's like Tom Brady's wife becoming the next quarterback of the Rams. It's like what? You hanging out? You just pick it up? I sucked at sports and then I banged Tom Brady and I don't know what happened. I just picked up a ball. I started lacing it. I'm leading receivers. It was incredible. <laughs> I knew it was going to be like this. You know what's funny? There's actually people out there that think a woman being president is actually a good idea. You know? Can you believe that? See that? They do. That'll do something. That'll change things. How? How the f*** is that going to change anything? Do you know what the president makes a year? The president makes 400 grand a year. That's it. He's trying to keep billionaires in line, making 400 grand a year. That's all he makes. He makes less than some people blogging on the internet. The president should have f*** you money, right? He shouldn't be sitting there with his pockets turned and saying, I need, I need your help to get me, get me the job, right? What, do you guys all donate to the campaign? Is that what it is?